all right welcome back all right on to this one according to father mbaka well a lot of things are happening in the country as we speak to the extent somebody is saying that if buhari believes that he's stubborn by force by fire by force he must be impeached and then that has been the person of father mbaka all right the news in details on to this one it says impeach buhari if he refuses to resign mbaka tells nas Praise for Namde Kano. Okay, controversial Catholic priest AGK Mbaka has withdrawn his support for President Muhammadu Buhari and called for President's impeachment over worsening insecurity in the country. Mbaka, the spiritual director of Adoration Ministry Enugum, is believed to be one of the key voices that contributed to former President Gulag Jonathan's defeat by Buhari in 2015. All right, onto this, he says, well, the Reverend Father had consistently campaigned against Jonathan ahead of the 2015 presidential election over the former president's failure to address ravaging insecurity and corruption in the country at the time but in the wake of daily kidnappings and incessant killings across the country mbaka on wednesday called on the national assembly to impeach president buhari if he refuses to resign voluntarily all right and then as it is the cleric made the call during a church program at his church on wednesday reports the guidance all right, Nigerians are crying because there is no security in the country. The National Assembly should impeach the president if he doesn't want to resign, Mbaka said. Uh, well, meanwhile, onto this, Mbaka wants that something was that something worse than what they can never imagine will happen to the members should the federal lawmakers fail to impeach Buhari or attack him for calling for the president's impeachment well until this is said enough has to be enough there is time for everything adding that nigerians are crying because there is no security in the country the national assembly should impeach the president if he doesn't want to resign all right and then meanwhile continue by saying that well mbaka also threw his weight behind nam the canon leader of the proscribed indigenous people of Bihafra IPOB, who has been an active voice calling for secession of Igbo from Nigeria. Meanwhile, according to the cleric, Canon has shown courage by confronting the Buhari led administration on alleged marginalization of people from the Southeast region. Well, until he says, I want to tell you something. Wherever Kano is, May God bless him because if somebody has risen to shout, his brothers are suffering. May the Lord bless his courage, Mbaka said. All right, onto this one, now, Mbaka, the prophet, in fact, the owner of this church, Adoration Assembly, onto this one, he has said that as soon as he buried, so by fire, by force, he must leave if he refuses because the way the people have been fair it has been unfair hmm. this is serious and then as it is a lot of things are happening in the country many people are not happy with the regime well a lot of people have like no come out to say that buhari must go just like what happened in the bible whereby a lot of people were crying the israelites so to say that pharaoh let my people go and then that is exactly what is happening right now a lot of people have been like Buhari waiting be the issue. Let us go. If you don't want us to enjoy the dividend of democracy, then let these people go now. Is it by force? Well, a lot of things are happening, no? Brutal killing of people on a daily basis. Hmm, it's uncalled for. Well, the truth of the matter is everyone is tired. Just like the southwestern part of the country, talking about Sunday. Igbo who onto this one, he has said that we must leave and then one thing they have been agitating about has been that as far as 2023 presidential election is concerned nobody will vote anybody yes we are not voting anybody if you try campaign do 
waste your money you are on your own well these people are so serious according to what has been gathered a lot of things had happened and then as it is we have to face it squarely where brutal killing of innocent souls has been ravaging the country and we are tired we can't continue like this how long are we going to continue like this and then onto this one impeach buhari if he refuses to resign father mbaka tells nas pray for nam the canon well a lot of people they've called nam the canon the group i pop talking about the indigenous people of behalf right they they have called them terrorists but these people are not terrorists they said we are just there to protect our people against fulani attack and then that has been it well a lot of things have been said well and even at it many people are of the opinion that if Father Mbaka can insist that a lot of people are ready to support the movement that Buhari must go. All right, and then a lot of people are even saying that, hmm, are you sure you'll be able to impeach this man Buhari? Some people were even saying that, in fact, this man Buhari has caused a lot of havoc in the lives of people, and then as it is, he must go. All right, onto this, there's been uh, reactions according to OK Frank underscore zero one. He says, Amen to the word of God. Buhari must be impeached. By fire, by force, we can't continue like this. Okay, and then as it is, a lot of people are still like, hmm, well, if that is the case, we are in support, sir. Hmm, that is serious. All right, my people, a lot of things have been said. Well, what more can we say? Well, onto this one, the controversial Catholic priest, A.G. Kimbaka, has withdrawn his support for President Mohamed Buhari and called for the president's impeachment over worsening insecurity in the country. Well, if you remember vividly 2015, Father Mbaka was one of the people that were soliciting, that were supporting the Buhari-led regime. But look at it now, everyone is tired. Well, what kind of a country is this? What kind of a man is this? And uh, it has been said that this has brought about the agitation of Odudua and the Bihafra in this country. And one thing has been said that when somebody is pushed to the wall, according to statement, it says when that a goat does not bite, but when you push a goat to the wall, definitely it will bite. Hmm, this is to tell you that hmm, my brother, there is no time. Everybody don't verse. All right, and then that has been it on this one, my people. Meanwhile, let me have more take from you on this. And remember to subscribe for more updates. Thanks and God bless.